Hi friends, I'm Sapna Agarwal, Creative Director of Ansa Interiors. And today in my design discussion series, I am going to talk about sustainable floor choices. Sustainable floor choices or floored by choice. When it comes to choosing a flooring at your home, there are really my red ways to go. And while the looks and costs are certainly going to be a key drivers in making, you know, you making your decision, don't forget that it's also so easy to build eco-friendliness and sustainability into the equation. So what really makes a sustainable floor? Uh, somehow it is a surface that is produced from readily renewable material via eco-friendly processes. It also creates a little impact on the ecosystems around its, uh, it in the course of its life cycles from the harvest through to the manufacture, to the use, and to the disposal, and to the disposal. So many sustainable floors uh, also have a social aspect to them. So in the traditional uh, flooring types such as uh, bamboo or sea cell, tend to rate highly when it comes to sustainability. And choosing such options ensure a future for communities that supply and manufacture them. If you are interested in uh, assessment based life cycle information regarding the flooring you are considering, then uh, I think there are a lot of websites. One of them is American National Institute of Standard and Technologies Building for Energy and Environmental Sustainability BEES program and uh, you can go to that website to compare the life cycle and environmental impact of the range of flooring you know as provided by the researchers around the world uh, top of its list comes the natural products such as coke linoleum wood with the wool composite marble at the other end you know wool and composite marble bilkul lower end pe aate of the scale due to their manufacturing and installation requirements so uh, what are some of the greener choices available to you some greener choices are hardwood wooden floors they have been popular around the world for centuries they really add a warmth and color to your interior scheme and are practical and easy to install and somehow unlike carpet are great for people with allergies what's more you know depending on the kind of timber you pick this is great environmentally responsible flooring choice to begin with trees are renewable resources but opt for species that are plantation grown and harvested commercially rather than the ones that are plundered out of native forestry they also absorb carbon as they grow and this remains stored in your flooring rather than being released as emission into the atmospheres so to add on a cherry on the cake at the end of its useful life beneath your feet you uh, have a wood which can be repurposed or recycled so that the carbon stays logged inside there have been many new technologies that have also been made you know they have made many types of hardwood floors much much easier to install than they have been at the past they can uh, even now be ordered prefinished or uh, there is actually no need to sand or seal the boards before or after installation they can simply be laid out out of the boxes bamboo i think has uh, been a traditional flooring in asia for like millennia to look at it can resemble the hardwood but it is cut from a rapidly renewing highly replenishable resource as uh, bamboo is a grass not a wood it grows to maturity in just 3 to 5 years it stores up to 70% more carbon a year than hardwoods and can also be harvested without the need to replant as you know the root system is left intact so is this also means ki hum jo uh, carbon footprint hai wo uska low hota hai uh, even while you are shipping it out of asia it all included uska carbon footprint low hai it is very strong extremely durable naturally antibacterial and resistant to insects and moisture which makes it like ideal for humid environments 
there are number of type of bamboo floorings available each varying uh, slightly in manufacturing processes economical variability and sources and preferences asia somehow bahut common form hai bamboo use karne ka you will see thin bamboo stems cut as flat as possible then they are trimmed to similar lengths the wood can uh, then be strained varnished or left with a natural look outside asia it is uh, more common to find uh, more highly processed manufactured bamboo floors these are generally made from mature bamboo poles again sliced into strips then skinned boiled to remove the naturally occurring starches and sugar the wood is then dried and you know uh, planed delivered to majorly natural occurring colors they are dyed Uh, this is like similar to uh, beech or oak then somehow unka look waisa hi aa jata hai it's when it reaches the lamination stage that the eco friendliness of most widely distributed bamboo floor tends to become compromised this is because it is generally bonded together using uh, formaldehyde resins which emit highly volatile organic compounds so uh, they aren't great for air quality at time that said being i think uh, bamboo uses uh, much less uf adhesives than other options because uh, such as you know particle free board substrates un sab se to kafi kam hi hai uski usage there are however bamboo products and systems available that don't use uf so these uh, locking bamboo systems are the easiest to install in fact with joints that click firmly into the place and allow you to create your own look using uh, plank alignment and color bamboo is an awesome product second most important product is cork cork tiles or planks are made from the bark of a cork oak which is carefully harvested from a living tree this means it is highly renewable and uh, sustainable flooring resource it is stripped from a cork tree once um, every 10 years once the tree is about uh, 25 years old each tree lives up to 200 years in terms of flooring performances cork has a lot going for it it is naturally micro antimicrobial it is a great insulator against both noise and heat loss and it is uh, just very comfortable under the foot its springy resilience also means it copes up well with the furniture placement and heavy foot traffic to you know round it off it's well resistant as well cork rates high on the green scale too to begin with as the tree it provides a living environment for other plants and for animal species it attracts a uh, few carbon emission in the course of the harvest and if your choice uh, if you choose your sealant carefully you will find that there are also low voc options available it is also highly recyclable once its days as flooring are done I think uh, linoleum is the third option. I like to say linoleum or true linoleum. It's also called lino. Also marked under the trade name of marble linoleum, has been around since I think 1850s. It is manufactured from 100% renewable resources and it is 100% biodegradable. Lino is a blend of dried and milled flax seeds. linseed oil pine resins ground cork and pine uh, and uh, with jute burlap and uh, it has that canvas backing it is highly fire resistant and it also anti static which makes it ideal for allergy sufferers further as it is uh, its decorative uh, pigments are embedded in the structure of the lino it just doesn't fade top quality lino is extremely flexible making it useful in environments where tiles etc would crack or uh, you know and it's very durable also there are cheaper linoleum available but uh, they are thin in cross section and won't last as long just make sure if you're opting for lino then uh, 
that is actually what you are getting uh, more commonly today pvc flooring or what we call as polyvinyl chloride flooring which have become uh, known as lino but wo hai nahi actually but it isn't really lino it yes i would agree pvc will wear well but it also contains uh, plasticiers chlorine contain combustion products and impurities such as free monomers which are less than environment friendly rubber rubber flooring i think is it tends to be associated with commercial and industrial spaces but i think with a bit of imagination it can play a useful role in your bathroom kitchen and laundry rooms as well in particular true rubber is harvested from the living rubber tree and is therefore 100% renewable resource as a floor it is uh, easy to install keep clean insulated against sound and vibration and is anti static so it's great for asthmatics it uh, should be fade resistant too you know again just make sure you get the real thing though synthetic rubber is not sustainable material carpet this is one of the interesting one given the sheer number of products from which carpet can be made perhaps the greatest surprise to be found here though is that wool carpets although wool is natural sustainable and renewable resource somehow it rates very poorly on a green scale in terms of all the published research this is largely due to not the wool itself but the you know energy requirements of the carpet manufacturer the voc given off by the adhesive used in the laying of the carpet and your choices of underlay that when i somehow those voc carpets are becoming increasingly available or you can use the uh, tax as they uh, used to do before the onset of glues pehle hum log bachpan mein tax use karte the ab somehow glue ke sath carpet chipakte hain and there are also more environment friendly neutral uh, things available underlay sab bahut sare aa gaye hain in the market so uh, whatever are your other choices if you are worried about wool carpet eco friendliness performance then you can choose sustainable carpeting including that made up of other natural material fibers such as uh, cotton sisal jute cotton husk again it's a case of looking into the manufacturing and installation of each individual product that you are considering you know particularly green options in carpeting made from completely uh, recyclable are very less because kahin na kahin usme plastic use jo hota hai wo bahut zyada ho jata hai there is a never ending source uh, of stuff recycling somehow it i think it is like a, it plastic to hamara aisa hai ki it keeps filling our landfills and uh, up to there are new things available wherein they are making carpets out of those plastic dyeing is less polluting it requires less energy and there are uh, other type of floorings available with plastic which can be considered as using those garbage or the disposable and you know making them of utility i think uh, the last i would like to say is coconut the timber of coconut palm is comparatively rare flooring choice but uh, is one with good sustainability credentials coconut palms grow quickly but the wood is usually harvested from 60 to 80 years old plants and there are uh, no longer producing the fruits coconut is a hard wood but uh, with uh, you know a usual appealing close grain it is cheaper than teak and is as hard as mahogany you should never you should uh, never see coconut as the way it is you should always see it as a friend it's a friendly flooring and somehow there are a lot of choices and you now have the information that can help you make a decision thank you friends for watching me I'm Sapna Agarwal and we were talking about eco-friendly flooring systems available. If you have liked the video, do ring the bell button, subscribe to our channel and for any kind of interior and architectural design consultancy, you can contact us at www.ansainteriors.com. See you next Wednesday. Bye.